How do I know if I can trust the information I find on the internet? The internet makes it easy to find information that can help with all your needs using something called Google. For example, you can use it to learn more about schemes that can help your family like those related to health, education and employment. You can even use it to search for prices of products that you use for your business. My family and I also search for useful information about farming techniques to increase our yield. This helps us with the vegetables that we grow for the family outside our house. When I use Google to search for information, it shows me a lot of writings, videos and pictures that might be useful for me. But not all the information on the internet is true or accurate. So I follow some steps to help me decide what information I can trust. Let me show you what I do. I take out my phone and press and hold the big button at the bottom. Google Assistant will open up. This is what I need to search the internet for anything I want. You see the mic button? I just need to press the mic and hold it down with my finger while I say what I'm looking for so that Google Assistant can find it for me. To get the information I'm interested in, I press the mic and say potato pests and diseases. I'm searching for information on potatoes but you can look for whatever you want to learn about. Once I've said what I want, Google Assistant shows me all of the different information it has found. I prefer to see videos rather than read, so I press on the word videos at the top. It now shows me farming videos only. Next to each video, I can see the name and logo of who made the video. I try to press on videos from names that I recognize and trust like agriculture universities or organizations. But it's okay to click on a video even when you don't recognize the name too. I've discovered a lot of good information this way. As you start to watch more videos, you might find people you like and you can watch more of their videos. Once I've found a video I'm happy with, I press the button that looks like a triangle to play it. After I look at a video, I go back and click on a few other videos to compare what they are saying. I press the right arrow to go back to the list of videos and choose a different one. This one is giving the same advice. But it is a farmer speaking and he is showing his actual field. So, I like it. My potato pests look just the same. If many videos are saying the same thing, I know the information is more likely to be reliable and correct. Sometimes you'll find information that is obviously wrong. Once I saw a video that said to put alcohol on your plants to prevent pests. <laughs> I knew that could not be true. As a farmer, I know how to be cautious. It's the same when I'm looking for information on the internet. If there's something that seems unlikely or makes you uncomfortable, I just ignore it and find a different video. Why don't you try? Remember, learning anything new takes a bit of practice. So watch this video as many times as you need and try out the different steps. Thank you for watching and enjoy practicing.